What's up, boys and girls? What's up, world? Mr. Miko here, talking about number 153, the C major scale and arpeggio. Now, arpeggio is a new word for us. It says an arpeggio is a chord whose pitches are played one at a time. Your first arpeggio uses the first, third, fifth, and eighth steps from the C major scale. Um, so what does that mean? That means sometimes we have uh, notes that we play more than one at a time. So there might be something like this. Three notes at a time, or sometimes more than three notes at a time. But an arpeggio is breaking down that chord, those many notes at a time, into just one at a time. Instead of all at once like this. Um, so in C major, we have specific notes that are going to be in our chords. And you can see them because they're a little bit jumpy. So let's go ahead and try this one out, making sure to remember what we have to do for C major. Now C major, it starts on our G string. We have F naturals on the D string, and then we have C natural on the A string. And both of those are low two or second finger for cello. So let's try this one out about this fast. Here we go. One, two, one, two, ready, go. So, uh, the bracketed portion was the arpeggio, and those notes were just C, E, G, and C. Uh, make sure for the whole note that you make sure it lasts for four whole beats all the way on an up bow, one, two, three, four, and then at the end also an up bow for four beats. Let's try this one once more, just a little bit faster. Watch for your F naturals in particular, I think. Here we go. One, two, one, two, ready, go. So you might have noticed I came in on one or two notes that were a little bit off but I just shifted a little bit until it was in the right spot. So I think my C was a little high at first, and then I just brought it down until it was the right pitch. So there's C major scale and arpeggio.